NBCChicago.com. Motorola rolls out its long-awaited droid. It's a smartphone that's taking aim at Apple's iPhone. NBC 5's Charlie Wojciechowski is all over it. There is a lot riding on this little chunk of plastic and silicon. When it's released in November, the Motorola Droid will give Verizon ammunition in its battle for tech-savvy subscribers with AT&T. Already, the advertising is taking aim at Apple's iPhone. But the Droid could be even more important for Schaumburg-based Motorola, which hasn't had a hit phone since the Razor. Obviously, this is this is critical for us, and, and we're super excited about it. But it's only one of of a, of a large portfolio. Motorola's Melissa Gardner walked us through some of the device's features and its Google-designed Android operating system. 400,000 uh, pixels on the screen. So what that does is it gives you twice the resolution than any other smartphone out there on the market. The Droid also includes free turn-by-turn -turn GPS and access to apps through Google's Android Marketplace, which functions much like the iTunes Store. Any developer out there, anyone in their basement, can actually develop something, an application for this device, and actually see consumers using it. We listened to our customer feedback that they wanted uh, uh, some devices to have more open abilities. The, the, the uh, Android uh, Marketplace gives us that ability. But while the Droid offers a keyboard and a better camera, experts say Apple's three-year-old iPhone may still be the smartphone to beat. I don't think that a phone like this is going to unseat the king because so far all it has is a marketing strategy. Flashy commercial, but no ecosystem like the iPhone has. Now the iPhone ecosystem includes everything from cases to speakers to those apps. The Droid is starting fresh. Currently there are about 10,000 applications on the Android marketplace. That compares to about 100,000 for the iPhone. Still this device does have a lot going for it, including things the iPhone doesn't, like a removable battery and removable and upgradable memory. It comes with a 16 gig card built right in. All right, the big question, how much? Uh, Two-year contract, $199 after the obligatory mail-in rebate. Not too bad. And I know a lot of people like that real keyboard, too. It is a nice keyboard, and it has both the keyboard that you can type on and a virtual keyboard that comes up when you touch the bottom of the screen. So need the glasses for that one, but it's a... Uh, <laughs> it's, it's a very high-resolution <laughs> screen. This is almost high-definition video that you can shoot wow. with this thing. Five-megapixel camera with a flash. We wish Motorola all the best. Charlie yes, has do. a new toy today. <laughs> At least all for right. this week. All right, thank